Over the past decade, craft brewing has become more than just a hobby or specialty item. Pubs and restaurants all over now cater to this type of beer making with great success. The Mayflower Brewing Company has tapped into this enthusiasm for craft beer for almost seven years and has become the fixture in brew houses on the South Shore. Well, being the local brewery in Plymouth was a key part of starting the business in the first place. Uh, when we said Mayflower Brewing Company, we knew it had to be in Plymouth uh, for uh, obvious reasons. So uh, the town and the South Shore as a whole has been very supportive of the brewery since we started. We've been in business for about seven years now and see nice steady growth throughout the region. So it's, been, it's really been terrific. The Plymouth community has been uh, supportive of the brewery. We have a tasting room that we're in right now that uh, welcomes guests uh, from the town and the uh, South Shore as a whole and of course from throughout the world as craft beer has become more and more popular coming to craft breweries to try the beer and uh, see what it's like at the brewery is, is a big part of what people really enjoy. So it's a bit like uh, wine tasting in the, the wine region out in California. More and more people coming to breweries, enjoying the beer and seeing what variety is available. We have these three warehouses back here. That's for all dry storage materials. Brewing happens here and packaging happens in the other room. So we'll come down to the main brew house. So this is a two-vessel system where we brew the beer. We basically are combining the water, the malted barley, and the hops uh, in the beer here. This whole process takes about three to four hours. And once we're done with it, we send it on to the fermentation tanks. Key thing is just doing the same thing over and over again, the same way every time. Because if you change the temperature or the time, the beer is different. So this is the packaging room. We basically put the beer into kegs and bottles. Um, roughly 60% bottle, 40% keg. Uh, served in bars and restaurants, and of course, in all the package stores. It's the most labor-intensive and expensive part of the entire brewing process is actually getting the beer into a container for consumers to be able to buy. So this warehouse is a combination of finished packaged beer and packaging before we put the beer in it. And uh, so it's just basically storage. We keep this room temperature controlled to make sure that the beer is in good shape before it goes out to the stores. Um, and it's getting more and more full as we get close to the holidays. It's a very busy time for us. So. We love having people coming in. It's a great way to get to know the brewery. We actually have some events from time to time as well. We've had bands here and uh, food festivals and things here at the brewery. So we welcome everybody in the community to come by and see us. I think you really have a great time uh, at the brewery.